GFBS held a Facebook Live event Sunday evening to give an update to the school district's plan this week. GFPS is not going remote this week and want to open as normal as possible. We open uh, as regularly scheduled. Uh, there may be some activities that are not able to um, operate as normal. They're still recommending uh, that people wear masks in public settings to slow the spread of COVID. Um, we will then open our schools on Tuesday morning with a recommendation strong recommendation that people wear masks in our public schools, students, staff, and visitors. While Great Falls is familiar with remote learning, there are parents concerned about it. This text message is from a parent who says they and the parents they know say their students are indifferent about remote learning, but the parents also feel that it isn't what students should be going through. Another parent told me that remote learning has its challenges, but they are making the most of it at their home and getting through it week by week. He actually likes the remote learning part of it, like the likelihood of having to do a presentation in front of the class is obsolete. And I'm super appreciative of the teachers that, you know, have had to change up how they teach completely between last year with, you know, the good, a good portion of the school year being remote, as well as the quick notification that they were going remote this last week. So, I mean, I really do appreciate their hard work in trying to make this work for the all of the students. I know that they do care about their students and, you know, it's not easy for, for anybody. Parents know that plans like this can change at a moment's notice. Remote learning has taught students and parents alike to be adjustable. This last week uh, for my kids, one being a freshman and one being a senior at Great Falls High, um, I'm grateful that they're pretty independent workers and they're good students. Um, they don't struggle so that makes it easier on us. I think they prepare them for it daily, that this could potentially be a thing at the drop of a hat, just like it did last week. I would rather have them in the classroom, obviously, especially with it being my son's senior year. I don't want him to miss out on all those um, activities and things. It's not ideal, but it's better than nothing. Um, and I hope it, if they have to continue to do it, it's short-lived. If you have questions regarding this coming week or remote learning, you can contact GFPS for more info. In Great Falls, Asher Lined, MTN News.